Well, it's so great to be with you all today. I'm Kim Lewis here at Bartow Family Resources. We're going to have a great conversation about what we do and how we serve the community and how you can engage and be a part of that. I'm so excited to have my good friend Ed Setzler with us today. Ed, thanks for being here. Good to be with you, Kim. We're, we're here today, and as, as I kind of host this and talk through this with Kim, we're going to talk today about what Bartow Family Resources does and who they represent in, 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 as they serve this community. Well, Ed, thank you for that. We're, um, we're always excited to talk about what happens here, but I also want to say congratulations for those of you who may not know Ed. He is um, the new senator in Bartow County. He serves the south end of the county and the Emerson Ackworth area, excuse me, the Emerson Altoona area. So we're, we're just excited to have you in Bartow a little more, Ed. So awesome to be able to serve this community. So. A, a great, a great guy that we're so grateful for. Uh, representing values that matter to all of us. So so what we do here at Bartow Family Resources, that's a loaded question, Ed. We try to have um, our elevator version, but then we want to expand on that and explain how this community has embraced us so beautifully and provided so many resources through the years. First of all, we're an organization, Ed, that serves primarily women and children. Um, we'll serve dads as well, but our focus is to serve moms that are in crisis with regard to their pregnancy or perhaps who already have a little one. We'll serve moms and dads with little ones up to age three. So the way that we primarily do that is through a fantastic program. It's a learn to earn program, Ed, that we call Babies and More. And we laugh around here because there's always more, more, and more. You know, it's not just about the one thing. So we provide diapers, wipes, formula. And as you can see, we're here in our beautiful baby boutique, Ed, um, where we are... Um, always busy with moms and families that are coming in to shop. Uh, everything we do is free. We um, absolutely survive on the generosity of our community, people that just want to be the hands and feet to serve um, those that are in need in our community, Ed. And so that's what we do. That's primarily how we do it. Um, our families come in, they are paired with a mentor, and then they spend time unpacking where is this client, what does she or he need in terms of their parenting skills, in terms of um, the things that they need in their, uh, is, it, is it housing, is it transportation, is it education, um, and we can unpack that a little bit more yeah. in a moment. Um, but then they earn the items that they get in the store, so it's not just a, a free handout, although we certainly want to make sure that anybody in crisis has what they need. Sure. Um, it's a program, and we want them to participate at least twice a month, Mm -hmm. And um, we will, again, as I said, walk with them up to the time their baby turns three years old with the resources and the support that they need. Super. I'm Jesse Weaver with Weaver Heating and Air. Uh, I am a second generation owner coming in. Uh, my dad started the business in July of 1973 and we're about to celebrate year 49. Uh, coming up, so we're really excited about that. Um, our our business has been based on family, uh, not only for ourselves, but for our employees, and also the customers that we serve. Uh, it's very important for us to not only provide heating and air, but we also like to be a part of the community uh, physically and monetarily to, to help out in any needs that we can. So now we're in our Napa Auto Care Center with Chris use our shop foreman over here chris it looks like we're pretty busy over here what all so for our public that don't realize that we've gone mechanical what all do we do over here uh you name it we do it oil changes oil changes alignments rotates brakes suspension uh we can put your tr new transmission in for you we can do your engine whatever you want us to do tune ups check engine lights absolutely uh so chris is our shop foreman over here this is our napa auto care center this is the mechanical side of the business Chris is doing a fabulous job. Y'all, if you need anything mechanical, oil change, whatever, give us a call. Hey, it's Chris Nichols from Cartersville Cell Phone Repair. Whether you need your phone fixed or it's time for an upgrade, we've got you covered. We sell and repair phones, tablets, laptops, smartwatches, and even gaming consoles. We also have a huge selection of phone cases for newer and older models. Need accessories like chargers or car mounts? Or how about a Bluetooth shower speaker? Forget your passcode, we can get past that for you. Or if you want to ditch your current network carrier, come see us for unlocks. We're behind Lowe's next to Pizza in Cartersville. I'm Glenda Mitchell with Glenda Mitchell Law Firm. If you've been involved in an accident, give me a call. 
let me help you. I give every client my personal cell phone number so you can call or text me anytime. Glenda Mitchell Law Firm, we come to you. Well, Kim, a lot of folks ask the question, you know, the government provides all these services and housing and things like this and so much money. What is it different that you all do that the government just can't provide to people who are in need in our community? That's a great question, Ed, and, and we do get that a lot. And people assume that the government just pours money into organizations like ours, which is not the case at all. Um, the government can assist in areas of need from time to time, but the government, Ed, can never care for people. They just can't. That's not their role in our in our communities and in our nation, in our world. And so that's where we step in in organizations like ours. We care for people because we truly care for people. We have over 100 volunteers, we have 20 staff members, and we have well over a thousand partners that partner with us financially um, or in the services they provide to help us love on and serve families. And that's truly what we do. Uh -huh. Well, who are some of the organizations within our community that partner with you guys in doing the important work that you do? Yeah, great question, because we wouldn't be as strong as we are and able to do what we do if we didn't partner and have those strong partnerships. The list is quite long, actually. Um, we partner with all our local nonprofits that serve um, children and families, such as Advocates for Bartosz Children, um, the Good Neighbor Homeless Shelter, Tranquility Domestic Violence Shelter, uh, partner really strongly with them. We serve a lot of the same families, so mm -hmm. we work hard to make sure that if there are moms in needs in those areas that we're meeting those needs and that she knows about us, and they're great to make referrals. Um, we also partner with the medical community in a beautiful way, Ed. We have a great partnership with uh, Piedmont Cartersville Hospital. We have a lactation consultant that comes in every week to work with our moms, mm -hmm. uh, give them a tour of the hospital if they're going to deliver here in Cartersville. Uh, we we partner with UGA and the Extension Office. They do a beautiful job teaching our moms how to shop uh, if they have WIC vouchers or if they have SNAP-Ed, um, which is like food stamps. Sure. Um, helping them know how to shop on a budget and create healthy meals for their family. Um, we also partner with the health department. We partner, as I mentioned, with local OBGYNs. We partner with local pediatricians who make referrals to us. So really anyone in our community that is in any way touching families, uh, we also partner with schools and school counselors. Um, they, there may be a young girl in high school that realizes that she's pregnant and doesn't know where to go, but she might go to that school counselor, and that school counselor then is going to pick up the phone and call us. Yeah. And we love that. We love our partnerships. We're, we're constantly seeking to grow and expand those partnerships, um, and we're thankful for them because we wouldn't be as strong as we are without others in our community that are serving as well. So, so it's fair to say that the government provides some big rocks of funding, right. but you guys fill in the gaps and really provide the soft touch that really makes the service work for people. That's right, absolutely. Because, you know, people want to know that someone cares, Ed. I mean, that's really what people want to know. Who cares about me? Yeah. Who's going to help me in this situation? Um, and sometimes even if we're not able to sit here and write checks and pay for rent, um, although we have done that and we can do that occasionally, that's not primarily what we do. Yeah. We're here to su supply the beautiful things that you see around us, the diapers, the wipes, the formula, um, the clothes. But more than that, Ed, it's the emotional component, um, the mentoring that we're able to provide through our parenting classes um, that is so important. And it's beautiful to see because very often our moms that um, are in crisis will come in and, and the reason they're in crisis is they don't have the support of their own family, that right. familial support right. that we all know is so mission critical. So, so, so government can provide financial resources, but only you can provide family resources, and that's really the connection point. That's right. It really is. In a compassionate, caring setting, the way that we're able to do it here, and uh, we're grateful for it. And it's, it's, it's truly a blessing to the community because these moms and families um, they need to they need to know someone cares and we're blessed to be able to say that to them and truly mean it here at Bartow Family Resources. Hey everybody, it's Kelly Jones here at Kennesaw Transportation. Um, just want to drop in and let you know that we're always looking for drivers. We run team drivers and solos, and then we also have a small training program. Um, we'd love to have you join us. Great company, benefits, pay. I just can't say enough great things. So call me. Our website is listed below. Thanks. Hey, guys. 
Tim here at Treasure Chest Outlet. Hey, why don't you come on in? Let me show you around and some things we've got here that you might need. Take a look at our sofas. We have reclining sofas. We have stationary sofas. We have a selection of sofas on the floor. We have more coming. Come on in and check them out. Hey, we have a large selection of rugs. Kind of take a look at what we have here. Pick out your favorite color. We have them in five by eights, eight by tens. We also have four by sixes. Four by sixes start at 29 bucks. Five by eights start at $79. And eight by 10 start at 129. You just never know what you're gonna find here at Treasure Chest Outlet. Welcome to Spencer Aesthetics, located in the West End Commons Shopping Center at 650 Henderson Drive. Our fun and friendly staff deliver exceptional treatments, including an enticing range of facials, fillers, hair removal, skin tightening, body sculpting, hormone replacement, and sexual dysfunction treatments for both men and women. Whether you want to feel more desirable or to simply age gracefully, you deserve to feel beautiful from the inside out and we will be with you along the way. Kim, tell us, what can people do to help Bartow Family Resources? That's my favorite question, Ed. And I would love to just say, you know what? If you're out there and you're wondering, what can I do to help that mom who is struggling? Maybe she's a single mom. Maybe, as we were talking earlier, Ed, maybe she's working, but she's only making, you know, $10, $11 an hour. She can't afford a case of diapers. Do you know how much diapers, wipes, and formula? Those are the three things that we always need, Ed. Diapers, wipes, formula. It's a simple little short list. People can pick these items up when they're in the grocery store buying their own groceries for their families, which I know that's expensive these days more than ever, but this really helps our moms in a practical way. They don't have the extra money to buy the diapers, the, the formula. Most of you, I know, were uh, very aware of the shortage that has happened recently, Ed, but you know, we were so blessed because we were able to fill in those gaps for moms that A, couldn't afford it, or B, couldn't find it. So diapers, wipes, and formula are always things that folks can bring in for us. Um, also, Ed, as, as you see these beautiful clothes here, we rely on our donors just like you on the other side of the screen in the community um, to collect these items for us, whether it's your child that's outgrown them or your grandchild, maybe you have a niece, a neighbor. We need gently used clothes, Ed, for infants, meaning zero all the way to size 4T. So infant to 4T, we always need those clothes. We need summer clothes right now. Um, as you know, little ones, you, you've got a family, Ed. You know how children can be rough on summer clothes. They're stained with popsicle and ice cream and mud, and they've been playing in the dirt. And so, uh, Actually, um, dad stains his clothes that way sometimes, <laughs> too, but kids especially. That's, that's right. Yeah, they do. And so, you know, they don't always last. So sometimes the things that we get in are a little stained. We do try to find things that are um, as nice as they can be. We, we appreciate secondhand clothes, and we want those, and we welcome those, but we do ask that they're laundered. So maybe there's a grandma that's watching us right now. Sure. You know, my parents love to go to estate sales, yard sales, and they'll buy baby clothes, infant clothes. My mom loves to take them home, wash them, get them all smelling good, and bring them in. And it's a really, it's really a big help. So, so the picture who we're talking about is a, maybe a 19-year-old single mom yes. that makes $11 an hour after taxes and everything's taken out. Her, her weekly paychecks maybe 250 280 a week yeah she and that's all it. she has to live on mm -hmm. and this just is a huge gap filler for them absolutely and not just the not, not just these products but also the, the becoming around them with volunteers and services what are some things people can do outside of bringing those important products in? Uh, like like baby clothes and, and, mm. and formula and diapers. Well, absolutely. And there are some people that really don't have time to, to shop and, and go and look. And that's great. We, we quite frankly, we need your money. We need your resources. Um, because we have a staff of 20 that are here running this incredible organization to serve families and um, and we have needs every day that go outside of the diapers wipes formula and clothing um, when we can we will help a mom if she uh, is short on rent maybe she's got 500 but rent 700 and we'll make up the difference when in that $200 um, we're constantly doing gift cards like gas cards right now gas is so expensive Ed. so you know sometimes they can't even afford to drive 
here to get the resources they need, well, even though they're getting them for free, uh, because they don't have gas in their tank. And so, so, so a hundred dollar a month donation on a recurring basis yes. every month, make it part of a kind of fit it in your in your family budget. It's a very easy way to make a difference. It would be incredible, and we rely on that, Ed. We rely on those uh, monthly donations because it helps us to fill in those gaps. It helps us to keep the air on. It helps us to keep the lights on here in this beautiful facility. For those who um, are maybe from Bartow County and don't know. Um, we are in the first hospital that was built in Cartersville. Actually, it was built in 1930. And so it's a beautiful space, but it takes resources to, to run um, a facility that's this large. We're about 10,000 square feet. And so there's just constantly needs um, to keep the building nice, neat, and clean for, um, for our families and to continue to keep it a beautiful place that's well-staffed and well-stocked. Um, it takes money. And so we rely on the community, and we're so blessed to have the support of so many of you out there. But um, we invite you to take action. Uh, pick up um, a can of formula. We like the powdered formula because it doesn't um, go bad, Ed, on the shelf so quickly. Um, we need diapers. Uh, we need wipes. We need formula. And these are very practical ways that people can get involved. So if, if you've ever seen people around you and in your contacts that have seemed to be falling through the cracks, that the system with all that's out there is not serving them because there's, there's just some gap there. That's what Bartow Family Resources does. Absolutely. It catches people who are falling through the cracks, meets them to their point of need in a way that I think folks in Bartow County can, can really be proud of yes. and actually be a part of. Yes. So, Kim, I just really appreciate your time today talking about this. Thank and, you. And, and opening up all the things that you do. Well, I appreciate you, Ed, and I'm very grateful for all of you that support the work that we do here at Bartow Family Resources. IPW was founded in 2000 by Melissa Vaughn in Charlotte, North Carolina. Uh, Melissa saw that the industry needed some accountability, not only for the customer, but also for the service provider. Uh, IPW, for the last 20 plus years, has been working with some of the giants in the industry. Uh, our belief is that our affordable care model can be both affordable, clean, as well as affordable in value. Uh, we believe here at IPW that the service should not be reflective of the price. Uh, we believe that what we can offer is a, a value and a service that goes far beyond what just it says on the invoice. We feel strongly in our people, we feel strongly in our product, we feel strongly in our customers that they believe in what we're trying to do. Our goal is to make them look good. Hello, my name is Rob Santangelo. Here at IPW's Regional Sales Manager, what I'd like to do is create new partnerships. A partnership that would put together a service package that is comprehensive and beneficial to you by protecting your assets, your investment, your brand. I look forward to speaking with you in future opportunities. Thank you. Here at IPW, we are always looking for dependable, reliable people to join our staff. We are always hiring for crew members and crew leads. Our crew leads are the ones that would take over the shift and also drive the equipment. So if you're looking for an opportunity to grow in a place where you are valued, then come join us. You can go on ipwwatch.com and click the careers tab and fill out your application and I'll be in touch with you very soon. Hey, this is Joe Wilson, co-owner of Parnick Jennings Funeral Home, Cartersville's locally owned funeral home, serving all of Bartow County since 1977. The biggest difference uh, of, of our funeral home here in Bartow County, Cartersville, is that we are a locally owned funeral home. Uh, we make all our decisions right here in the funeral home. When people walk in the door, they're going to meet the owner and know that we're making decisions on what's best for the families that have placed their trust and confidence in us and the needs of our community. We want you to know it would be our honor to serve your family during your time of need. Please call us at 770-382-0034. Kim, a lot of folks are excited about the services you provide coming alongside of, of young mothers and families, but what they don't know is all, of, all the medical services you provide. Could you talk to us about the medical services that Bartow Family Resources provides right here in our community? Absolutely, Ed. Great question. So um, we've been around as an organization for 33 years. 
Um, but it wasn't until 2017 that we actually had the space uh, moving into the location where we are now um, to open a pregnancy medical clinic. And it's been a tremendous blessing for our community. Um, healthcare is expensive. And um, a lot of times moms that we serve are either uninsured or underinsured, mm -hmm. Ed. And so what we do is we step into that space um, when they are most vulnerable with free pregnancy tests, free ultrasound. Uh, we also offer free STI, STD testing um, because again, that's very important and women can't afford these types of tests, these types of services very often. And so we love doing that in our clinic. And then as we have moms that realize that they're pregnant, and uh, they want to parent, but perhaps they just don't feel like they've got the support that they need or they don't have the finances. I know we've talked about that already. It's a beautiful thing then we can just walk them from our clinic right into our Babies and More program that you and I have been talking about where we can help them with their parenting skills. We can provide the emotional support. Um, and the material baby items that they need as we've been as we've been sharing so it really is um, a beautiful little clinic and um, we have a medical director um, we have um, a, a physician in town who reads all of our ultrasounds so it's not just a bunch of volunteers that are kind of hit or miss um, it is an accredited medical clinic and uh, we partner with um, several organizations in town, medical organizations, OBGYNs, uh, pediatricians, and um, also, as I mentioned earlier, we partner with Piedmont Carswell Hospital, and um, it was, so we're very grateful for these partnerships and the referrals that they um, give us, um, as well as our local health department. So um, you'd mentioned earlier, um, or asked me earlier, Ed, about our mobile unit. Mm -hmm. So I'd love to just share that that is something that we're now offering here in our community. And actually, we go into North Cobb. So we cover the mm -hmm. Ackworth area yep. that you're, sure uh, you're stomping grounds, Ed. Um, but on our mobile unit, we're able to offer um, those services as well. We offer free pregnancy tests and free ultrasound for those that may not be able to physically get to us. So uh, we serve in different points around the county, different days of the week. So, so to, to be very specific, you think about an ultrasound, um, an uninsured woman, an ultrasound costs $100, $150 to, to, to have yeah, normal. Yeah, even more, usually $250. $250, mm -hmm. wow. So this is a, providing that free. Yes. Um, is a $200 to $250 unplanned expense for, for, for a young mother that's, yes. that's, um, um, that's, that's just, just putting some specific numbers. I think it's important to see that. I didn't, didn't even recognize what a big impact that could make. Yeah, it, it really is an, uh, an important service that we offer that a lot of folks in the community don't know about. Uh, we want school counselors. We want youth pastors. We want anyone working with young teens or um, young adults to be aware of the services that we offer here because it's one of those things that you don't need it until you need it, right. you know? Um, and we also do options counseling. We're, we are the specialist in Bartow County for, op for options. What are your options, okay? So you're pregnant, maybe you weren't expecting it, um, and so you're scared, you don't know what to do. Um, we go through that um, and give the medical perspective on prenatal development, um, on what to expect, um, as a mom, um, as you're pregnant, you don't know what's happening, and you're scared, you don't have anyone to go to. Or, or as a dad, there's or as dads a dad. that have the same questions. Absolutely, and we, we love our dads, we invite our dads, we want our dads to be part of our program. Um, again, all of our services are free, and um, Edwin, every year we go back and look at our numbers, Every really every month we do that, every quarter we do that, um, and it is astounding um, the amount of free services. Just our organization here in Bartow County um, has been able to give over the the, the last 10, 20 years, but um, in any given year, I mean, we are providing um, at least a quarter of a million dollars in free services to our community, wow. at least. So, so, so just as you provide material needs for yes. people in these circumstances, you f that, that fills in important gaps for them, you're filling in important medical gaps as That's well right. because you're a professional medical organization with doctors and clinicians that can, can deliver services in a way that perhaps people didn't even realize that you did. That's right. It's an important part of what we do. Um, and we call that section of our organization BFR Medical. So um, perhaps you have a daughter, a granddaughter, you work with youth. Um, we want to be sure that you all are aware that we offer that as well here at Bartow Family Resources as BFR Medical. SOS Mattress, best quality, best price, guaranteed. 
Where can you find a huge selection of high-end mattresses without paying high-end prices? SOS Mattress, best quality, best price, guaranteed. Where can you save 50 to 80% off retail every day? SOS Mattress, best quality, best price, guaranteed. We offer the lowest prices on the best name brand mattresses. SOS Mattress and Clearance Center on Highway 41 in Cartersville, one block south of Home Depot. Hello, Cartersville. If you haven't been by lately, come on by and check us out. We've totally revamped the store. We've added a lot more large capacity washers for your big loads. We have 40 pounders, 60 pounders, and 80 pounders for those huge loads. If you've got large bedding, come on by and see us. We've got the machine you need from a single person all the way up to a multi-family. If you're tired of doing laundry yourself, we offer a wash, dry, and fold service where you can drop it off. A few hours later, come back, it's ready to wear. We're located at 406 North Tennessee Street. It's All American Coin Laundry. Come by and see us for all your laundry needs. In conclusion, Kim, you guys are doing great work here. What would you leave folks with as they wrap up today and think about Bartow Family Resources? Well, thank you, Ed. Bartow County is growing, and the needs in Bartow County are growing. The needs of families, the needs of infants, the needs of toddlers, the needs of moms, the needs of dads, they're growing. And this is a place where you can plug in and truly make a difference. Anybody can do it, Ed. But maybe you say, well, I don't have that much um, to offer. I don't have a lot of extra income. Well, maybe you've got $10 or $5 and you could become a monthly partner with us. It's so easy just to go to our website. It's bartofamilies.com um, or, you know, send me a message on Facebook or swing by. We're at 200 Leak Street. We're very easy to find. We're centrally located right off Main Street. And uh, people can get involved in great ways or small ways, but it's, it's all great to us because we need... Um, we need the continued support of our community, and we're, we are so grateful and blessed. Um, there are over 80 centers very similar to ours at, across the state of Georgia, yeah. as you well know. Um, but truly, as I've traveled in and out of those centers, um, learning from these other um, executive directors, our center is absolutely one of the strongest in the state of Georgia. And it's because of, of our incredible supporters here in the community, just, just moms and dads, um, school teachers and business owners, and, and churches that want to just partner together and say, hey, we want to love on families. We want to put our money where our mouth is. We want to put our resources uh, in a way and in a place that makes a difference. And truly, I can say that that happens here at Bartow Family Resources. And just as the needs of Bartow are growing, yes. your needs are growing. That's we, right. need, we need more people to be involved to really help, help Kim and her team make a difference. We do. So thank you. We look forward to hearing from you soon. Thanks, Ed. It's been fun to be with you today. Do it, Kim. Is it possible to have too big of a smile? Too much laughter? Can you have too many thrills? How many rides are too many? Maybe you can have too many funnel cakes, but funnel cake capacity may vary from person to person. Can you actually have too much fun? Yep. The good news is you recover quickly enough to come back again next week. Buy your tickets at lakewinnie.com. If you've been injured in an accident, call the Glenda Mitchell Law Firm. Give us a call anytime. You'll talk directly to me. Let this specialist in auto accidents fight for you. Call 770-694-1883 today.